Hello Capricorn, Sun, Moon, and Rising. This is your this is your energy reading for the week of July 27th to August the 2nd, 2020. Um, as always, please take what resonates with you and leave the rest. Um, if this reading does resonate with you, I'd love if you leave a comment. It'll help me better connect with your energies for my future readings. And please remember to like and subscribe. I've pulled five cards. The first two cards are in the, the past position. The third card is in the present position. The fourth card is um, potential future energy. And the fifth card is potential outcome. Um, for the past position, I've pulled the Hermit. Um, and the Four of Wands in the present, and Three of Pentacles, Earth Energy um, for the, the Fourth, the Hanged Man, and for the Fifth, King of Pentacles, another Earth Energy card. All right, we'll start with the Hermit in the past position, the first card in the past position. The Hermit, of course, refer, is a major arcana card. It refers to um, solitude, reflection, spending time alone, um, and um, that can be positive or negative. It depends on how you use it. it depends on the on the surrounding circumstances. So um, it looks like perhaps some of you have spent in the in the recent past or perhaps the more distant past, you spent some time alone and in reflection, perhaps growing spiritually, thinking about your life and reflecting. So that's the hermit. Also in the past position, we have the Four of Wands. The Four of Wands tends to represent celebration. Um, we see a wedding canopy here in the on the card. Um, so perhaps there's been a celebration of some kind or you've been just feeling a sense of celebration in your life of some kind. Perhaps you've, perhaps um, this, the time you spent in solitude and with the Hermit card, um, you know, led you to a greater, um, a deeper sense of understanding about yourself that you've, that you, that you, that you enjoy having now. And the third, the third card we have the, with the third card we, in the present position, we have the, um, the three of pentacles. Pentacles, of course, is earth energy. Earth energy has to do with material resources, money, um, finances, everyday practical concerns. And, um, as we see, as we see with this card, the, um, with the um, the mason, he's um, he's um, carving um, you know carving um, his um, I'm sorry I can't think of the word he's 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 a, he's a mason you know creating creating a beautiful artistic carving and um, the two, these two people are approaching him and, and finding out about his skill um, the three of pentacles can point to perhaps you have a skill that you're teaching other people or perhaps you're learning about a new skill or you're Becoming curious about um, a skill, you know, a skill that you know that can be this practical and can earn you money, and that and that you know will um, will help you help you progress in the world. Um, and it could be a creative skill, specifically like the mason. Um, perhaps is a creative skill that you can use that will also um, help you financially and in a you know everyday practical sense. So that's the three of pentacles in the present position. In the, um, the potential future position, we have the hanged man. The hanged man it represents a um, new, new, completely new perspective. So, as we see in the imagery, everything's being turned on its head. So perhaps in the in, in there's potential in the in the near future, you might suddenly have a completely new perspective on suddenly have a completely new perspective on something. Like everything's turned on its head, and you have you're looking at things from a new perspective. So that's the hanged man. And in the potential outcome position, we have the King of Pentacles. As I said before, Pentacles is earth energy, money, finances, everyday concerns, practicality. The King is holding a coin, and um, th this is a court card. Court cards can um, represent people in your life specifically. Like, or like in, in the ca in the case of a, of a King, it would be like a middle middle aged older man. Um, in the case of the King of Pentacles, it would be a man who has great command over money, like very practical, common sense, that kind of person. Um, or um, it, this could represent, represent a part of yourself that has that has a very good a very good grasp on that or who wants to have a good grasp on that. Or this could represent just a part of, just something to do with circumstances and your potential outcome. So going over the cards again, we started with the Hermit and the Four of Wands, so solitude and celebration coming together in the past. 
in the present, we have three pentacles, earth energy. We have, um, you know, you know, a creative but very practical skill, the creativity and practical sides of life coming together for, you know, for financial betterment. Um, and then in the future, the potential future position, we have new perspectives with the hangman. Maybe perhaps this will help bring you some new perspectives. And then we come back to become we return to to the to earth and material resource resources um, with the King of Pentacles. So perhaps you're using those skills coming into this and maybe you're really coming into your own using this new perspective. So I hope you've enjoyed this reading, Capricorn. If you did, please comment and subscribe and like. I hope you have a wonderful week and I'll see you again next time. Bye.